Hi guys. Hi loves, good morning. <clears throat> Can you guys hear the music in the background? Or should I put it louder? <laughs> So this is going to go for a replay, but what I wanted to do was, um, I want to do like a little meditation Monday kind of thing. Um, this is something that I wanted to start doing once I got situated and comfortable in my home. So if you're not able to stay, the whole duration may be no more than like 10 minutes, but um, it's basically every Monday I want to get on live, do a meditation and then it'll be on replay so that if you wanted to, um, hi guys, welcome. Um, if you wanted to catch it later, you can totally catch it later. But the whole purpose of this is, um, is to have a meditation for you to like sit through and just relax. Um, so I'm off work on Mondays. So I'm gonna try to get these out like in the mornings so that it'll be available all day. Um, so that if you wanna tune in later to meditate, you can tune in. Um, but I just wanted to kind of try this out and see what you guys think. So if you can't stay, that's okay. If you can, great. But um, I say to get pretty much have a crystal if you love crystals. And if you want to, you know, get a certain crystal to meditate with. So I'm going to be meditating with my um, amethyst. And I also have a palm stone here. It's a amazonite palm stone. So if you um, want to grab a crystal right now, and then I'm going to pull a card for us too. Just something to focus for the Monday. <laughs> and then we'll start our meditation, okay? And like I said, if you guys can't stay, that's okay. It'll be available in replay. Okay, so I'm gonna pull our card, the card for the day. Hi, my loves, good morning. Meditation Monday. <laughs> Get your crystal ready. A crystal you wanna meditate with. I'm gonna pull a card for us and then we're gonna do our guided meditation after. Wasp spirit, sometimes life stings. <gasps> sometimes life stings. Okay, so how are we going to do this? I feel like for, for some people, some people are going through something rough. And I feel like for some of you guys, you may have recently been seeing a lot of the posts up about, um, about like, how amazing the moon is and how amazing this energy is and some of you may have not been able to relate to that and so you may have been finding yourself a little bit annoyed a little bit left out um so sometimes life stings sometimes this this is what's popping up here for today's kind of our, our focus for today when life stings we really have to kind of do a check-in with ourselves why is what is whatever it is that is hurting us hurting us why is it triggering us why is it causing us to feel left out of the group right um yes it's a beautiful deck <laughs> um so i feel like for some of you guys um if you've been feeling left out because you couldn't um, resonate with the moon energy and all of this crazy you know astrological stuff popping up and you're just you're reading the posts and you're thinking i i can't relate to that it's not resonating with me um don't feel left out understand that at certain times things are gonna mesh with you and at other times it's not um, and when it doesn't it's kind of a time for you to go in and de and, and think about what is it that is triggering me and why is it causing me to feel this way let's pull another one and you know when life stings oh so butterfly we get we're getting insects today you guys 
Butterfly Spirit Transformation is Beautiful. Transformation is beautiful. When it comes down to change, change is freaking scary, right? Change is scary. Change can be um, hard. Change can be hard because you're, you're, you have to be uncomfortable to change. You have to go through a, a, a session of just this like weird phase where you just don't fit, like you, like you don't mesh, you know? Maybe that's what this Sometimes Life Stings card is about. Maybe some of you guys who are going through a big shift right now, you're feeling like you're being attacked left and right, and you're not vibing with all of this positive energy that we're seeing people post about, you know? Um, so butterfly spirit transformation is beautiful. I feel like some of you guys who are currently going through a transformation embrace it. I feel like those of you guys who are going through, um, big changes in your personal life, you know, and, it, and they're not always positive change. You know, change doesn't always have to be positive. Sometimes it's a, it's an uncomfortable place to be in. I want you to focus on that today. When we meditate, focus on if you're, if something's bugging you, Focus on that. We're going to work on getting rid of it. So I, I'm inspired now that I pulled the cards um, for today's meditation. We're going to be doing more of a let's cut cords. Okay, let's do a cord cutting meditation. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that, but cord cutting meditation is you're cutting cords, energetic cords that you have attached yourself to other people, belief systems, feelings. Um, and I feel like that's going to be a good one for a lot of us today. So if something's bugging you or you're going through some big changes and you're not really feeling as pepped up and as great as other people are seeming, making this seem to be, you're okay, okay? You are okay. And because I like to work in threes, let's just pull one more and then we'll get into our meditation. Eagle spirit. Spirit has your back. Spirit has your back. So no matter what, your guide, your team, whether it's angels, your spirit guides, your past loved ones, God, um, his holy army, whoever, whatever, however you want to believe, um, you have protection, you have a support system, and you may not be able to see them, but you could probably feel them. They are there and they are around you and they're cheering you on in whatever it is that you're going through. So what a beautiful little message to kind of look into. Um, I think for me personally, I'm going to focus on the life stings kind of portion because I feel like, um, that's the one, that's the one, the big one here, um, that, Sometimes shit happens and sometimes stuff doesn't feel good and sometimes things people say or do will, will anger us um, And sometimes we have to learn to let it go and by letting it go you cut those cords So that's what we're gonna do for today's meditation. So if those of you guys who are still in here <laughs> um, This will be available in replay. I want to start doing Monday meditations so get your crystal and um, Let's do a little meditation. This will only be maybe about five minutes. So just to get us ready for the week, okay? So go ahead and get seated. You can close your eyes. You can watch me. <laughs> Take in a deep breath. Breathe out. Take in another deep breath. Hold it and breathe out. And as you're taking in these deep breaths, I want you guys to focus on centering yourself. You'll start to feel like your energy, like just zoning in, get comfortable. You can close your eyes, you can keep them open. If you're sitting down, put your feet on the floor. Put the soles of your feet on the floor. If you're sitting, if you're laying down, that's okay. Start grounding those feet, your roots. Start grounding them into the ground. Imagine them going deep into the center of the earth. You're tethering yourself, symbolically saying, I am grounded and I am focused and I am present.
And let's put ourselves in a nice little white glow of protection. So whatever color you associate with protection, imagine that starting from the top of your head, your crown chakra, and let's expand it slowly down, down the sides of our head, down the sides of our neck, over our shoulders. Just imagine that light engulfing your body, down the sides of your arms. It's radiating, it's warm, it's comforting. It's a protective shield. It's going down over your face, over your throat and your heart. Imagine it falling all the way down your belly, your back, your hips, your legs, down to the ground. You are engulfed in this white, golden, green, whatever color you associate with protection. Sit there in this moment and feel it absorb into your body. And tell yourself, I am protected today. No bullshit can get to me. I'm present in my moment. Now let's take a deep breath in. And out. Let's do it again in. And out. When you take your deep breath in, you should feel your entire body blowing up like a balloon. And when you let it out, I want you to imagine just murkiness, all of that gunk, all of those negative thoughts, those worries, those stresses, those people, everything. I want you guys to breathe it out, okay? So start gathering it up in your mind as we breathe in. Hold it and breathe it out. And do it as many times as you feel you need to. It's symbolically, you're, you're just getting it all together to blow it out. protected. I am present in my moment. I am here. Nothing can get to me. And I release whatever no longer serves me. And I want you to start imagining. I, I'm, you're probably already seeing it. You're seeing people's faces. You're seeing feelings, memories, Whatever recently happened, whatever's been bothering you for the last few days, months, years, bring it all forward. And I want you to imagine it in front of you. And you have energetic cords that are attaching you to these people, to these thoughts, these memories. Imagine that it's like tentacles coming out. I want you to focus on one or two things that are really bothering you right now. And we're gonna focus on getting rid of them right now. So bring them forward, bring them present. And if you have a crystal in your hand, you can, you know, you can use that to cut your cords. You can do so with a hand movement. You can do this all in your mind. Whatever way feels natural for you, but we're gonna cut those cords, those tethers that are holding us to something that is bothering us, either in this present moment or that has been a long time coming. So you got that tether. And we're gonna cut it. No longer serves me. Let it go. Let it go. Cut it. 
no longer serves me, I let it go. I release myself from this thought, this person, this memory, no longer serves me, I let you go. And watch it fly away. Do it as many times as you feel like you need to. You no longer serve me, I let you go. And I want you guys to keep focusing on that. Keep doing that. You no longer serve me, I release you. Those thoughts that keep bringing you back to the very beginning, that hold you back, that person that never makes you feel good about yourself. That memory you can't get rid of that causes you to not sleep at night, I release it, I let it go. That negative feeling, that thought that you woke up with this morning, let it go. And those of you, if you see it, if you are detaching yourself from certain things, you're gonna feel little holes. You know, you may see little holes in your aura. Let's patch those up. Bring in that light. I patch it up. I heal myself. Bring in that light. I have pat I patch those holes up. I heal myself. I'm preparing myself for my day today. I will have a beautiful day. Everything is a lesson. I am present. I'm amazing, I am powerful, I'm beautiful, I am strong, I'm everything I am meant to be in this moment. Everything that I encounter today is for a reason. I'm beautiful, I'm strong, I'm powerful, I am full of life. Sometimes life stings. Sometimes life is emotional. <laughs> I'm feeling emotional right now. Some of you guys are really feeling it hard. Sometimes I am transforming and sometimes change is so hard. But I can do this. I can get through this. I am powerful. I am beautiful. I am strong. I am full of life. And I am ready to take on today. I'm ready to take on today and the rest of the week. Set those intentions, my loves. Whatever we happen, don't, don't just think it's going to be a positive week. Just think whatever happens, I'm ready for it. You put on that shield of protection armor. Try to do that every morning. As soon as you get out of bed, that's the first thing you put on before you even put on your new clothes. Do it in the shower. Two seconds, I'm shielded. I'm ready for today. I'm beautiful, I'm powerful, I'm strong. I am ready to take on anything that comes on to me today. Everything is a lesson. Take in a deep breath. Breathe it out. Let's bring ourselves back into the present slowly. Wiggle your toes. Wiggle your fingertips. You're coming back to life, back into reality. You're clean, you're cleansed. You're ready to take on the day. Open your eyes in the present moment. And there you go. 
So I hope you guys, if you watch this in, the, in live or if you watch this in the replay, I hope you have a beautiful day and a wonderful week. I'm going to try and do this every Monday so we can set a nice little tone for ourselves. And those of you guys who don't know how to meditate, it's nothing spectacular. I mean, you could, we can make it as woo-woo as we want, but simply closing your eyes and being present is all it takes. So I want to teach you guys how to, you know, just set a tone for your day. We'll pull a card, um, you know, we'll focus on like a, a, a topic. I just felt like after I pulled the wasp spirit, I feel like some of us are dealing with stuff that's hurting. And so I felt like a cord cutting meditation was, was the one that we needed to do. Um, so if you weren't able to catch this in the live, it will be available for replay for the next 24 hours. So I encourage you guys to go and watch it. Set your mood, set your tone. And those of you guys who went through the meditation today, um, I hope you feel good. I hope you feel powered, empowered. Maybe you, you cut some cords and you got rid of some stuff. Um, and get ready for your week. Have a beautiful rest of your week, my loves. And I will catch up with you soon. Bye, love.